How to make money with PLR. Hiya, Adam Payne here with the Video Marketing Insider and in today's video, we're gonna look at different ways that you can make money with PLR content. Now, PLR stands for Private Label Rights. And what that basically means is, you purchase content created by somebody else and then you are allowed to rebrand that content and do a variety of different things with it. For example, sell it directly, use it on your blog, use it on your YouTube channel, use it to create emails. Now, before you go ahead and buy some PLR and try and you know do some fun things, you need to understand what your rights are. And every package has different PLR rights. So make sure that you clearly understand what you are allowed to do and what you are not allowed to do. So assuming you understand your rights, let's kind of scroll down here because I've written a really good article on this whole topic and let's talk about a couple of things. So the first big section here, what can you do with the PLR that you have? So maybe you've bought some articles, you've bought some videos, a done for you email autoresponder series, who knows? Unfortunately, most people will tend to be a bit lazy and use it as is. Now, I understand why that happens because people buy PLR because they can't come up with ideas, they don't have the time to create their own content, so they want some professionally made content to use for themselves. However, you're gonna get much better results if you take a little bit of time and put in a little bit of effort to change things up a little bit. So for example, with articles, maybe you can choose a different title. You can add different subheadings or more subheadings to the article. You can write a couple of extra paragraphs. You can paraphrase things. You can add an intro or a summary. Now you can do this yourself, or you can use third-party tools such as conversion.ai. And if you click on the um, I right now in the corner of this video, um, there'll be a review video on that. And I'll leave a review post as well in the um, description of this video. So there's that. When it comes to autoresponder series, you're going to want to make sure that you add your links. You're going to want to make sure that you add your personalization and maybe add some more emails to the series. Um, email marketing is super, super profitable if done right. I've got videos on that, which I'll leave links to in the description as well. But having PLR as a starting point is really useful because it can be a little bit tricky to come up with ideas. So if you're building a list, and you should be, then you can use PLR to help you communicate with your list and build a relationship. You can also rebrand the PLR, so you can take the articles, you can add your links, your logo, your name, and then you can turn them into PDFs. You can give these PDFs away as lead magnets, or you can sell them. Again, it depends on the rights, but it's a great way to take a bunch of articles, combine them all into one big article, turn it up, turn it into a PDF, brand it a little bit, make it look nice, and then you can sell that on a platform such as ClickBank, or you can just add a PayPal button to a sales page and a Stripe button to a sales page and sell it that way. And you've got a product that you can sell to a list that you already have. You can run paid ads, you can get organic traffic, you can sell it inside of a Facebook group. There are tons of ways if you're a little bit proactive. Here, you can use PLR to build out websites. Inside of my own video content PLR platform, I actually do this. I show, well, I show people how to do it. And I'm building out a site in the numerology niche. So you can buy a domain, install WordPress, and then you can have your articles that you've purchased from a specific PLR vendor um, Add to them, expand on them, and then put them as articles on your new website, and you've got some content. Now, you might not want to build out your website. In that case, you can use these articles and anything else and videos as eye candy for domains that you can potentially flip in the future. You could go to a free website such as expireddomains.net. You could buy some expired domains, install WordPress on those domains, put PLR content as eye candy, and then it will have a higher perceived value if you can sell that domain to the highest bidder. And again, all these things take a little bit of action. You've got to be a little bit proactive, but they all work. What else can we do? You can take the PLR and you can use it for social media. You can take uh, excerpts of articles and you can use them as social media posts to help brand yourself, put it on your Facebook page, use them as tweets, tons of things you can do. And again, this will save you time as well. If you've bought video PLR, and that's something that I sell, then you can use this to kickstart your YouTube channel. And if you have a bunch of keywords as well, which is also what I provide, not only do you have videos to kickstart your channel, but you've got a whole bunch of keywords that then you can use to plan out future videos and grow a channel that way. And a YouTube channel is a great way to build trust. It's a great way to grow a brand, 
get people onto your email list, into your Facebook group, and then sell there, or sell products directly from links in the, in the description. You can create um, audio products. So you can turn text into audio. There's free resources such as Audacity. You can read the, read the articles aloud, or you can get this done on Fiverr, and you can turn them into audios. You could sell these sell these audios or you could put them on SoundCloud and get traffic from SoundCloud back to your website or whatever it is you want to do. If we come down a little bit, you could even develop a membership site. Now that might sound a little bit technical, but there are tons of simple ways that you can develop a membership site. There are lots of plugins or scripts that you could use with WordPress. You could get people to log in and then you can deliver some content inside and charge people a few bucks each month. Maybe you want to take the articles and turn it into a newsletter. And that's easily done inside of Google Drive. You can open up, open up a Google Drive doc, paste in an article and then print it off as a PDF with a little bit of branding and then sell that as series one of a newsletter. And you could sell it directly inside of your email autoresponder. Now, I know a lot of the things I've spoken about here, I've not actually shown you physically how to do it. The trouble with showing people how to do it, click here and then click there, is that you'll show somebody something and then whatever you've shown them, that interface changes and the training becomes obsolete. Now, if you would like help and guidance on different ways to monetize PLR, how to make money with PLR, the first step, click the link below this video and go and read this article. There's lots of things in this article that I've not mentioned in this video. And if you'd like to be handheld, then I will leave a link below this article to my own video content PLR, where we've got a ton of training, a Facebook community, which will help you with different ways that you can make money with PLR. Any questions, let me know. Thank you for watching. Please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell notification. And I'll see you in another video shortly. Take care. Thank you for watching. If you've got any questions or you need more clarification, go and watch the video once more. Over on the right hand side, we have some more trainings and reviews, so go and watch those as well. Please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you've not done so already, and hit the bell notification. Other than that, ask any questions you've got below, and I'll see you soon.